Some people say we're all connected. All part of some bigger picture. Some harmonious flow. Endless and meaningful. Maybe that's how it looks from a distance. But up close, with eyes open, I see no evidence of any spiritual choreographer at work. No, I see nothing but the random fractures of a selfish, queenless hive. Never looking. Never stopping. to logged should be a nice quiet night see you tomorrow yeah we'll do relationship I've ever had in my life with a bunch of metal bimbos look at you my beauty you could keep me in college for over a decade to flight. Uh, you can leave the keys to me, sir. I'll park the car for you. I'm not the driver, son. I do beg your pardon, madam. No problem. No tip. Him or her. Fuck. Thank you. You know, sometimes choices are so small you don't even see them. You are your decisions. That's what shapes you. And that last one shaped me into a little bit of a chauvinist. Just like that pig in a suit.
need the keys to the Maserati. Does he stop the rent, though? Of course he does. Okay. Okay, then you want my signing for it, then? <sighs> okay. He doesn't know. It's a secret, but I really need those keys. <sighs> it's just for tonight. I'll be back before two. I want to know why you need the car. We don't need to worry about that. Fine. I won't. <sighs> okay. I made a bet. A stupid bet that I could turn up at this party in a Maserati. <sighs> that was rash. How much did you bet for? A grand. A grand? <sighs> a hundred of it is yours, if you let me have those keys. Two hundred. Okay. Three hundred. But it... You said two hundred way too quickly. Look, would you rather be a seven hundred up or a grand down? I'm trusting you, yeah? It's not free. <laughs> two hundred in cash tonight. In cash tonight. I'm good for it. No more fast cars tonight, all right? Turn around. Slowly. Now get over it. Drop it. Smart. Now get in the car. Oi, dickhead. Does it look like I can drive? You get behind the wheel. You want me to drive you out of here? That's exactly what you're going to do. feet onto a concrete floor. This is your idea of a slick operation. Dripping DNA all over the place, kidnapping the first innocent bystander. I got the card, didn't I? It's outside. 
Jesus Christ. And who the hell's going to drive it? Because you're clearly not. I'll be all right. Fucking idiot. It has to be four people. There is no way you can manage the auction assistant and everyone downstairs on your own. I'm well aware of how many people it has to be. You have to call it off. Do you want to tell Mr Wu that we missed the one chance to get our hands on his fucking rice ball? Because I don't. We have one window of opportunity and we're going to use it. Fine. How? Leave him to bleed. Need to make some calls and try and find a replacement in the next... Shit, in the next 30 minutes, call Danny if he doesn't pick up. Try and get hold of that, you know, Irish Pete. What about him? Let's put a bullet in him. I don't care. Look, I, I don't know who you guys are or what you're up to, OK? I'm not going to say anything to anyone. Well, it's not going to take you long to figure it out, is it? Well, no, not if you keep talking in front of me, it won't. It'll be on the news, smart ass. Let me... I'm not a murderer. I don't intend to start now. <sighs> Pass me Diffinoxin and a couple of cable ties. Diffinoxin? What the fuck is that? Guess would have headaches like you. Hold still, making things worse. <laughs> Your headache's gonna start the moment you knock me out. And why is that? Because your mate on the couch there, he may have brought you the BMW, but he's brought it here with a valet key. A valet key, what the fuck is that? It's a parking key. It means you can't drive faster than 35 miles an hour. Not great for a getaway car, is it? And why do you think it's a getaway car? Your face? Is this fucking right about the key? It puts a block on the electrics, but we can sort it. No, you can't. You can't do it without triggering the immobiliser. But I can. Well, you can. Yep, certainly can. Looks like you just bought yourself a ticket and bought this operation. Are you serious? Are you going to go to the basement? We've got no idea who he is. After tonight, we're not going to see him again. What difference does it make? The difference is this guy looks like trouble. Well, Mr Wu is trouble, and we've made a deal with him we can't go back on. What do you say? I don't care who does what. As long as I get my car. You better not fuck this up. Okay, let's get set. And what do I get in return? No, what's your look? So what's the plan? This is what's going to happen. I'll double up on Lee's position. And this guy, what's your name? Matt. Matt, sticks with Mei Ling. You take up the slack. Super. Okay, we need to get moving. We need to be the auction house before nine. Oh, this one. You're joking. We'll find you something. <laughs> doing it. Nerve going already? I'd just like to be prepared, that's all. A very powerful Chinese clan called the Choi's are here tonight to reacquire a porcelain ball that has been in the possession of their family for over a thousand years. Reacquire? What went wrong? A careless business transaction. So we're here to help them get it back? We're here to stop them getting it back. I presume we're not buying it. What do you think? Great. You know, I gave up stealing a long time ago. To do what? To study. Then tonight's your lucky night. How do you work that out? Because the only thing studying will get you is unemployment. Failed education is still no excuse for stealing, you know. We're stealing from people who are prepared to spend millions on a piece of pottery when there are far more worthy causes in the world. What on your worthy cause are you? Tonight I am. Yeah. Yeah, I guess you could see it that way. You know, maybe you've got a point about relieving some of these people of a sliver of their money. Welcome to Hainsworth's. The second part of the auction has just begun. Thank you.
910 to my left. Thank you, sir. 910. 920. 920. Thank you. I see you. 930. Again to my left. 940. Do I hear 940? 940. Thank you, sir. Looking for 950. 950 to my left. Do I hear 960? Fair warning. I'm selling. 950 once. 950 twice. So, for £950,000, this marvellous 12th century cabinet with its hidden compartment, which is... £950,000. Just try to keep it powder dry. I'm sorry. If I had that kind of money, I wouldn't spend it on a fucking sideboard. Sorry. Why don't you try not talking at all? So we come to what I feel must be the height of our sale this evening, lot 247. And to introduce it... First, I'd like to pass you over to our expert, Miss Katie Tramp. Katie. What we have here is an absolutely exquisite example of late Ming Dynasty porcelain. Downstairs now, mate. Is the ball there? One of only three simply beautiful pieces. remaining examples okay, great. of the red the phoenix time. pattern known to be in existence. Sebastian, if you would, please. Thank you very much indeed, Katie. It is a truly exceptional piece, the sale of which cannot be passed without remarking that its owner, Mr Samuel Parr, who is far too modest to mention it himself, has agreed to donate 50% of the sale proceeds to the Chinese Art Restoration Fund. Yeah, we can't afford it. What did we say about not talking? And so, we shall begin the selling. Thank you, Katie. Thank you, Sebastian. And I would like to start the bidding, please, at two million pounds. Two million. Thank you, madam. Two million I have to my left. Three I'm looking for. Do I hear three? Three at the back. Thank you, sir. Do I hear four? Four. Four to the lady. Thank you, madam. Four I'm bidding. What the fuck are you doing? Do I hear five? Yeah, what the fuck are you doing? Five, you get 20% of the Thank sale price, don't we? Phone. Five I have. Do I hear six? Six I'm looking for. Six to my right. Thank you, sir. How powerful did you say these toys are? Do I now hear seven? Seven I have. To the lady. Thank Please you. Stop man. bidding. Seven. Do I hear eight? Eight I'm looking for. Eight with you, sir. It's your bid. Looking for nine. Matt, stop. Do I hear nine? Nine in the room? The odds are not good. Nine, I'm looking for. Price increases on a logarithmic All around the room. On zero. Nine million to you, sir. Thank you. Yeah, the chance of getting away with another business. Do I hear nine five? 